What's up, Deadbeat? In this video, I want to talk about the importance of building an email list if you're into affiliate marketing. My name is Dan Brock, the Deadbeat Super Affiliate, and I have to admit that in the past, list building hasn't been one of my fortes. It's just kind of been something that I've been doing on the side, kind of like uh, as an afterthought. I regret that a lot today, and I want to show you why. So what I want to do is actually switch to my computer and walk you through the traffic stats of my YouTube channel, this YouTube channel that you're watching right now, and show you why it's so important that you focus on list building when it comes to affiliate marketing, selling your own products, or any kind of marketing at all. All right, let's jump over to the computer and we'll jump right on it. All right, Deadbeat, so here I am logged into the subscriber account for my Deadbeat Super Affiliate YouTube channel. Now, what I want to do is just show you these stats and kind of in the process teach you a very valuable marketing lesson that in the past I've kind of violated foolishly. I knew, I knew this was the reality, uh, but I kind of got a little bit short-sighted and didn't maximize the power of this particular marketing uh, law. All right, and that law is is that it takes an average of seven introductions to an offer uh, before someone takes action. All right, so in the past with a lot of my affiliate niche sites, basically what I was doing was trying to go for the sale right away. And basically, so in other words, I would have a YouTube video or I have blog posts and it'd be like, here's the information that you requested, now go buy stuff. And it worked. I mean, one of my top affiliate sites right now makes $10,000 a month in profit and I don't have an email marketing list. But right now it's really occurring to me how much money I've been leaving on the table month after month by uh, not doing this. And we're not talking just like a few extra thousand dollars uh, a month. I'm talking literally like three or four times the amount of profit I'd be making right now if I did it the correct way. All right, so what I'm gonna do is walk you through these stats and just kind of show you what happened uh, with the channel growth over time. All right, so the, the, the channel launched in February 2018, uh, February 2016. And the first spike here, this initial spike in subscribers was when I sent my first video out. If you subscribe then, you remember that crappy video I made, it was basically like how to become a super affiliate. Uh, it wasn't the best video, but it was good content in my opinion, and you might have taken action and subscribed at that point. All right, so I continued to publish videos. Ooh, my back is killing me here, I'm sitting like this. So I, I continued to publish uh, videos and you'll see about a week later, I published another one which got an additional 17 subscribers. So I sent that out to my email list, 17 people subscri subscribed at that point. Now over about a month, I sent out more videos to the point where you see it kind of died out here uh, with about four subscribers uh, who took action. But I kept going, I kept pushing through, and I kept creating content, and you'll see that the, actually, the amount of subscribers went up over time. Now, granted, some of these people came in through, uh, some of the subscribers came in through other avenues like YouTube search, through some of my blogs and other stuff. But the majority of these spikes relate to me sending an email out to my email list and sending people to the new video. So I want you to think about, like, you might have seen my channel initially over this first month. Why didn't you subscribe then? What made you subscribe two or three or even four months later, like look at some of these spikes, four months later. So you'll see if you look at this graph, the majority of the subscribers came months afterwards. By the way, if you are subscribed, I just wanted to say thank you for supporting this channel and supporting me over the years. I know I haven't been perfect. I've made some, some mistakes in the past, but I am growing. This has been a big growing phase for me. Thanks for sticking through it with me. If you followed me over the years, you're the bomb. Thank you. I am going to be delivering massive value on this channel for a long time to come. I just wanted to say thanks for uh, joining me here. Anyway, sidetrack. Where I'm going with this video is as an affiliate marketer, start thinking about how you can implement list building into your affiliate campaigns. Over the next weeks weeks to come, I'm gonna actually show you how to convert an affiliate review site into a list building campaign. It's very easy to do, so stay tuned. Also, if you're interested in affiliate marketing and you don't really know where to start, I have a guide that you can access right here for free. Uh, for a limited time, that's not gonna be forever. And that guide will walk you through step-by-step step how to build your first affiliate marketing campaign from scratch, even if you're a beginner, if you don't know what you're doing. So get that here. Uh, also, subscribe to my channel if you haven't. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be releasing new stuff, like I said in the future, about adding list building to your affiliate marketing, building online income, motivational stuff, and more. Subscribe, share this video with your friends, and comment below if you have any questions about list building, affiliate marketing, anything of that nature. I am here to help. So feel free to comment. Remember, I'm lazy. It might take me a minute or two to get back to you. 
All right, deadbeats, hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in my next one.